The Guzzler SV60 and SV60V are heavy-duty, air-operated, vacuum-loading, pressure-discharge solids pumps. When used correctly, the SV60, as shown here, is capable of transferring up to 12 cubic meters per hour of high solids content material. The pump operates on a continuous cycle, alternately loading, then discharging. When using the SV60 or SV60V, SuperVac recommends that all operators follow safe working procedures. This includes carrying out a risk assessment of the work to be performed and wearing appropriate PPE. Setup. Locate the unit as near to the job and on as level ground as possible. Ensure the air supply hose is in good working order and to check this, blow the line to remove any foreign matter prior to connecting it to the unit. Always ensure you install the appropriate safety clips and or whip checks as required. Next, connect the suction line and pick up nozzle as shown here. Ensure they are all in good working condition and check all the safety clips have been installed. A bolt can be installed across the nozzle to prevent oversized lumps entering the nozzle if necessary. You then need to connect the discharge line. The SV60 and SV60V can utilize a wide range of pump lines. These include polypipe, rubber braid hose, and lightweight steel pipe. Ensure the correctly rated discharge line is used. Lay flat hose is not recommended. Warning. To prevent injury, ensure the discharge line is anchored securely at regular intervals. No road the discharge area if there is any possibility of personnel entering the area. Make sure you carry out a final inspection, ensuring the SV60's air supply valve is in the off position. Ensure there are no personnel in the discharge area. Turn the supply air on. Operation. Turn the air supply valve on the unit to the full open position. The SV60 will immediately commence the discharge cycle. This ensures the vessel is empty prior to commencing the load cycle. The pickup nozzle can now be introduced to the material to be transferred. The pickup nozzle can be removed and reintroduced to the material at any time during either cycle. The pump requires a minimum working pressure of 80 psi to function correctly. Pressure can be checked on the gauge at the discharge end of the pump and this must be done while the pump is operating. The pump is factory set at 10 seconds discharge, 10 seconds load. These times can be altered to suit the material and distance being pumped. Once pumping has commenced, observe the operation for several cycles. If necessary, adjust each timer as shown until you are satisfied with the throughput. The SV60 manual has a guide to correct setting of the timers. The unit will now continue to transfer at the set rate as long as material is available. If the task and layout permit, the SV60 may run unattended, although SuperVac recommends regular operational checks are carried out during this period. Always use a watch to check the timers. The numbers on the timer dial are a guide only. If either the discharge or suction are blocked, the stored pressure in the vessel can be relieved by doing the following. Removing the cover, turning off the supply air, and discharging the pressure by lifting the safety valve. On completion of pumping, do the following. 1. Remove the nozzle from pump material. 2. Run pump for at least two cycles to ensure the vessel is left empty. The Guzzler SV60 and SV60V are the perfect way to transfer high solids content material. They are another high quality innovation from SuperVac.